Okay, here we go. Sex scenes. Yeah, the big question about Queer as Folk, was it uncomfortable doing the sex scenes? Um, and I'm not going to give you a pet answer like you hear from people, uh, well, I am going to give you a pat answer, um, about them, but it's not going to tie directly to the sex scenes we did on the show. The pat answer for most of them is sex scenes are always uncomfortable. Okay. That's, nothing is always true. If anybody who's watched my stand special knows that never say never is stupid and, and always is another worthless word. And in, in particular, I have no doubt that there are voyeuristic actors who get some sort of thrill out of perf simulating sex in front of a bunch of strangers and having it filmed. And that's beyond the fact that they know that they're doing the work of creating a character and the character's sexuality is a part of that character and intrinsic to the storyline and necessary. They, beyond that, kind of like it. Kind of like the idea that people are like their body, want to see it filmed, all that kind of stuff. I work with those people on the show... Uh, and I work with the exact opposite on the show. So, and I work with that in plays, and I work with the exact opposite in plays. And it, like, I've worked with that kind of personality type exists in everywhere. It's like, it just, like, if you work an insurance firm and you go to fetish balls, that's what you do. That's who you are. It is, the, that type is everywhere. So, when people say sex scenes are always uncomfortable, that's not, I'm gonna shut the door because the TV's too loud. Um, the, when, when people say sex scenes are always uncomfortable, that means they want you to think that they're uncomfortable for them because they don't want you to think that they're a pervy weirdo. So there's all sorts of cover that goes when you're talking about these things. So it's difficult to actually give an answer that um, it, it, it has to be just your answer. And the problem is the awareness of everybody doing it, I'll just get to it, never mind. It's, it's too big. <laughs> you to try and tamp down on one thing. Like I said, I'm going to do multiple videos about these because I can only handle one. It would just be too long. <laughs> um, the, the initial one was, was it uncomfortable? Okay. There's two questions there. And, and two questions in the one question, depending on who's asking. So I want to address both versions of it. One is, um, was it uncomfortable in the generic sense of being naked in front of other people? Or being semi-naked. Because we wore uh, a, uh, a pouch on our junk. or And sometimes a towel draped over yourself in front uh, during walk-around. And we had robes on us when we weren't actually in the process of shooting. And I'll explain the actual technique of, sh of shooting it. And how we actually went about that process in another video too. So like and subscribe and all that kind of stuff. And uh, if, if you're interested and you want to hear that, just mention that in the comment section. Okay, so... That being said, <clears throat> is it uncomfortable for me? I can only answer for me. I can only answer for me. Okay. As a comedian and as a person who's comfortable in his own body and relatively fit, like I, I'm okay with the shape of my body. I've never been um, in, in a circumstance where I, I don't wear a lot of tank tops. I don't walk around the house naked. I like being clothed. Um, I don't sleep naked. I have more, uh, kind of, um, yeah, I just don't walk around kind of in nothing. I don't go to the beach that often. I'm kind of pale. Like I don't, some would say translucent. I just don't walk around unclothed a lot it, because it's not something I need to do. However, in the circumstance that I have to, I kind of don't care. Like when I, if there are, you know, if, if somebody's in the living room and I'm in the bathroom and I have to go past it or whatever and I'm naked and there's no towel or some circumstances never really happen. I'm just kind of giving a hypothetical. Uh, um, I, I will cover myself up in front mainly out of politeness, but I kind of don't care because it's kind of funny. You know, that's, it, you know, it, there's a lot of room as a comedian and as, a, as an extrovert. I kind of just don't care. I just don't. It's not that big a deal to me. I don't have a problem with nudity. And so when I found myself in those situations, I didn't feel like, oh my God, any second covered up or make the crew be naked or, you know, in their underwear while they're shooting so they know what I'm going through. Some people need that. I didn't feel that. So that part of it, being naked in front of other people or doing these kind of physical things wasn't uncomfortable. Um, it was cold. 
<laughs> it was cold, and they would spritz us to make us look like we were sweaty, so we're shooting in winter a lot of times, and the studio is cold, so you're cold, and they're spraying you with water because they want it to look hot and sexy, like you're just having so much sex that you're just sweaty. Um, when you're not sweaty. You're not sweaty. You're not sweaty. We're stopping every, you know, 12 seconds to change angles and shoot it and whatever. You're not sweating. You're not sweating. Nobody sweats in a sex scene unless they're shooting it in the Bahamas at noon uh, under a plastic tarp with old-fashioned lights on them. Like, there's just, yeah, you're not sweating. So, but they want you to look sweaty, so they spray with water and that's funny and, uh, yeah. Anyways. <clears throat> Okay, so that's the question. <clears throat> is it uncomfortable just being naked in front of other people? That's part of the question. And you're wearing the sock and people are staring and that's normal. People will just eyeball parts of you while you're standing there if they're so inclined or if they're not so inclined. It has no bearing on their own sexuality or their own circumstance. It's just something kind of oddly prurient about the human nature where they'll, if your ass is right there, they'll go this. Whether they, whether they want to look at it or not, there's no bearing on it. It's just a natural reflex. And you can see that in videos all over the place of, you know, people going, oh, about a naked person, even if it's not their tendency, that it's not their sexuality, if it's not, if they're not currently excited, you know, they're just like, oh, naked person, what do you know? Um, so that's the first question. Does the, it, were you uncomfortable doing them in that regard? That's the first version of that. The second one was, because they're gay. That was the big thing. Is it, was it uncomfortable because they were gay sex scenes and you're straight? That was, that comes up a lot against gets asked a lot. And the reality is no. It had no bearing on my discomfort or, or comfort in doing the scene at all. Um, the, the sexual aspect, who the partner was in these particular scenes, had no bearing on my comfort level. It didn't bother me at all that we were shooting, uh, love scenes and I was with another man that had it, it was right for the character it made sense for the story it was the the actual way Michael has sex with his partners was germane to who he is as a person namely facing which was a big aspect of it um uh Bobby Gant and I um had discussions with the execs about the fact that I believe that Michael has sex face to face because he's he represents the loving connection, and that was important to me. Um, to make sure that people knew they were in love, because that's that's another story too. What people think they're afraid of in the show, and what they were actually afraid of in the show. Okay, so so one, were you uncomfortable because you're naked in front of people? No. Were you uncomfortable because they were gay, sexy? No. Not at all. That the the discomfort that I felt ever was mainly physical to the environment. That's it. I felt so proud that we were actually shooting something worth doing that, I mean, I just never came up. Like, I don't, it's actually one of the questions I don't get. I, don't, I mean, I, I get it all the time, but I don't understand it. Like, it doesn't, and it's not like I don't understand how people would ask that question. I just don't think that way. That's it. And it's probably why I was able to do the show and why I'm comfortable talking about it and, and, and the like. That's it. So... Uh, were, were the sex scenes uncomfortable? Ultimate answer? No. Hope that answered your question. If you have more questions, put them in the comments section below. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll answer more questions. And if you want to, you can tweet me at Hal Sparks and put the hashtag QA family on there and, uh, and I can get the questions out. Thanks so much. Mm -hmm.